Hi there, I'm Andy Hillier and today's guitar lesson is going to be on Black Sheep by Metric which um, features Brie Larson. It's from a film, uh, Scott Pilgrim vs The World. It's a lovely little song, it's really easy to play, you can play it on any type of guitar, electric guitar or an acoustic guitar. So I'm going to teach you that today but just before I do, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, it really does help me out. Give me a like on the video, leave me some comments in the comment section as well, let me know your requests, let me know what you thought of the video. And if you love what I'm doing and you want to support me, keep me doing this channel, and you want to print the tabs off for this, I'll put them on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. My guitar's in standard tuning, you can play it on any type of guitar. Uh, the intro part just goes like this. It actually goes on for a bit longer, but uh, all you've got to play is the open E string, and then D2. And you just jump between those, go. Up speed it goes. So that's the intro, first line, nice and easy. Uh, then it goes to the verse. Now the verse sounds like this. So for that, we've got an E power chord, which is first finger on A2, and you're gonna play the top two strings, so the open E and A2 at the same time. You can do a bit of palm muting if you want, resting the hand on the beginning part of the string, and want them um, to be a rest in between each one. So if you can get, your hand to touch the strings, either your left hand or your right hand, doesn't matter. Just make them all nice and sort of staccato. So you're gonna hit four of them per bar and there's three bars, so we've got. And then it goes to this G power chord, which is your little finger, E3, third finger, B3, second finger, E3 nearest to your face, and hopefully that will touch the A string so it doesn't ring. And we just hit this chord four times uh, downwards. So the whole of the verse goes one, two, three, four. That repeats, uh, and then it goes to the bridge, which you could actually play the same as the verse, but there's also a little line that goes over the top that goes like this. So for that, we play B5, and then B3, so we've got rest, and then B1, and then open B. So the first bar of the bridge, bar 9, goes rest. And the next two bars are exactly the same, so let's play bars 9, 10, and 11, go rest. And in bar 12, we just got that G power chord again, just hitting it four times. Uh, bar 13 is the same as bar 9, rest. Bar 14, just a slight rhythm change, it goes rest. Same notes, B5, B3, B1, and B, go rest. Bar 15 goes back to the same as bar 9, rest. And then bar 16, We've got a B power chord, which is first finger A2, third finger D4. You could have just those two, but I've added my little finger on uh, G4 as well. And just four hits on that. So let's try the whole of that line. Here we go. One, two, three, four, rest. takes us to the chorus. Uh, so we've got some chords for this. Uh, first chord is a G chord, which is your little finger E3, third finger on B3, second finger E3 near to your face, and first finger on A2. Uh, or you could play the other type of G where you just put your third finger on E3. Any G is fine. And the rhythm I've put in here goes down, 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 up, down. Next chord we need is a B minor chord, which is your first finger A2, second finger on B3, third finger on D4, little finger on G4. Same rhythm. 
then E minor, which you just need A2 and D2. Any fingers on those would be fine. Then we've got a D chord, which is your second finger E2, first finger G2, and third finger B3. Same rhythm again. Um, and in the first chorus, it plays that line four, uh, twice. And in the second chorus, it plays it four times. Uh, so let's just play that line through once. Here we go. One, two, three, four. So again, uh, you'll play that twice in the first chorus. Uh, when it goes all through again, it, it plays it four times. Uh, and then there's one more line uh, which goes just before um, it comes round. So it's like after the chorus. Uh, and it's the same chords, but slightly different order. So it goes G, B minor, E minor, and then back to B minor. So you get this. And that repeats twice um, after the chorus uh, before it then goes to the intro sort of part for a little bit and then it goes back to the verse, bridge, chorus round four times and then plays this same line again and then that's the whole song. Well hopefully you've enjoyed this little lesson, especially the person who requested it, thanks for the request. Uh, if you have enjoyed it, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel which is Andy Hillier, it really does help me out. Give me a like on the video, leave me some comments in the comment section as well, I'd love to hear from you guys, let me know where in the world you're from. Um, what you've thought of the video, what songs I should do next. And if you love what I'm doing and you want to support the channel, keep me doing this, these videos. Uh, and you want to print the tabs off this, so I'll put loads of tabs on there. Um, you can check out my Patreon page, I'll leave a link to that in the description down below. Thanks for watching this, I've been Andy Hillier and I'll see you next time.